Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to be making a short video regarding making music in Linux. And today I'm going to be taking a slightly different route. Typically, people would just show you uh, some of the native programs to Linux. And I'm not going to do that. And the reason is pretty simple. This video is aimed more at those people who have just recently switched from Windows to Linux. And of course, with that, they're probably more used to the workflow that you get with Windows, where things typically work out of the box first time. Luckily, uh, there's a program here called Reaper, which is something that I used in Windows for about three years. And uh, basically, here's the problem. I had this fairly massive collection of VST instruments, and when I switched over to Linux, I couldn't use them anymore. Yeah, what I did find is that if I ran this program in Wine, it works pretty much perfectly. So not only do I get to keep using my VST instruments, um, my MIDI keyboard connects effortlessly, and I actually find this program works better in Linux than it does on Windows. Uh, you'll have to excuse it for a moment because uh, I'm running the screen recorder, so things are a little bit slow. Okay, it's really taken its time, so here we go. <clears throat> so as I mentioned previously, uh, if you come up here, you can see that I have loads of VST plugins installed, and they all run without any problems. Um, there are a couple of VSTs that I've found that don't seem to do so well, but I'm pretty sure if you installed a couple of extra things in Wine, you would have no problem with them. Installing a MIDI keyboard is as simple as going to Preferences, MIDI Devices, and just select it on the list. This probably isn't going to turn out too well, but I was going to try and play this for you. But with the screen recorder on, I think it's going to be too much uh, for my PC to handle, but let's give it a try. Yeah, just as I thought. But typically this works so much better on Linux than it does even on Windows. Bear in mind this PC that I'm using is two years, uh, two years old. Six years old, uh, close to seven years old actually. It's got two gig, two gig of RAM, a pretty poor processor. Yet uh, I can load a lot more instruments into this and tracks than I could on Windows. One thing that I do need to point out, if you look up here, it says evaluation license and uh, this isn't a free program however the license uh, the demo version is pretty special compared to a lot of other programs usually most programs will limit the functionality this doesn't get limited at all this is fully functional you're supposed to just use this for 30 days and uninstall it um, but a lot of people unfortunately tend to overdo that they use it for a lot longer I would urge you to buy this if you find it useful I'm planning on buying it sometime soon I just haven't had the money so that's Reaper in a nutshell um, there's not too much that I really need to say about it apart from just download this program give it a try and I think you'll be mildly impressed with it 